Hey, I'm the final anomaly, and today I bring you by far the strongest Endymion deck yet. Super Heavy Samurai just negate. Vanquish Soul, meet the mighty master of magic, and Manadium, barely an inconvenience. And then there's the Maxi Challenge. Well, the mighty master ain't scared of no roaches, unless they're flying roaches. The most underrated deck with some of the highest recovery I've ever seen. Master one more times than I can count on my fingers. Somebody stop this deck because Endymions are disgusting. Alrighty y'all, so for the next match here, it looks like Shadow is going first. Now Shadow, walk us through the board and let's see who you are going up against. Okay, so we first have to get the Blue Boy package. It's like, okay, this is good. Looks like there's no, um, looks like that was off here. How to use secrets here. We're gonna wait because we want Institution to search, um, that, the card we used. We got Institution new. But unfortunately, we forgot to pack our uh, insect repellent, so we get Roach. Oh, big ol' Roach. Mm -hmm. Big ol' Roach. I'm like, okay, well, we still gotta do the full challenge here, but our hand is actually pretty good. So we're gonna actually go for the whatever we can. To go remove three counters to get the Servant. But when Cerberus pops itself, we get four counters, two on each Institution. Now we're just going to go into Electromite real quick. Looks like you're going to get a good amount of draws here, huh? Mm, yep. Oh, we, this is just, um... We usually can do this all in very low, limited amount of searches and draws. Like, he's only got, like, two draws here. We get Garuda back in our hand for extra disruption. And Garuda is very, very good for the deck. And you're about to see why, why he's basically helpful. I'm gonna do that here. We're gonna use Mastery first though, because you wanna be able to pedal summon everything in one summon so that um Maxi gets the not very good searches and stuff. Not very good draws from Maxi. Got two negates and extra decks and one in hand. I'm thinking I'm not done yet. Go servant effect. Summon out another negate. And then we go servant and electromite into Selene, which is another negate. I'd rather get another negate on board to give him an extra draw than not than need that negate and not have it. All right, so let's take a look. Yep. He got to draw one, two, three, four, five is what he started with. He used the maxi, but he still drew. So pretty much, he only drew four cards here. Right. Look at that. Press the I. Bottom right. Yeah, Card maxi is four. They they always end up they're paired with nine cards and such. Um, it would have been eight cards. Um. But Cerberus popped itself and summoned Jacko King, and Jacko King popped the summon it out. Usually we just go Servant Resolution to go into Electromite. So we got to draw an extra card for free. Uh, usually with those nine cards, you have a sixth negate, negate on board. Okay. So usually now, we can just keep, negate as many cards as we give them. Keep in mind, y'all, that's not that bad considering a lot of other decks give them just about the half their deck when they try to go combo. So that's not bad at yeah, all. And then you, en can, you ended with what? Cards. Two Spell and Trap? Two effect negates and then whatever you want with Celine, correct? The Garuda bounce. Don't forget about that. And the Garuda bounce. So this is five. You have five disruptions here, essentially. We have six. Two negates, two spell tap negates. Celine, which is either one, which is the fifth, and Garuda as the sixth. Oh yeah, six. You have six disruptions oh. here. Um, for uh, him drawing or the opponent drawing four extra cards. I mean, that, I mean, considering, right? You don't want them to draw, but considering mm -hmm. that's not bad at all. Now mm -hmm. let's see how the opponent deals with this board. And okay, so it looks looks a, it looks a lot like Cash Tira, but that's oh. just a funny way of saying Vanquish Soul. All right, Vanquish Soul. We're negating that. We don't want. Uh huh. Yeah, we gotta negate that. Because you don't want to do it. So we got two of our negates out. Paradictomy. I was like, I don't want him drawing into a lava golem or something like that. Get rid of our negates out. But we don't want him using Rejecki. Get ready to um, um, remove the. Get ready to take off the. Uh, the. Fast forward. 
All right. That rota. Okay. Okay. I know that switch is Raiden, so let's stop that. And I want to be able to keep the counters on Undeviant. That uh, could get follow up in case he destroys him a battle. Oh! Lo and behold! What? A wild Kui Kara appears! Oh my god! He turns on Tiger Whoa! Okay! Yeah, wow! Yeah, Was that. 300, but no. Was that a Super Poly? That's everything. <laughs> yeah! Whoa! 9300 would have been the game, but we summoned Garuda. Garuda is our last line of defense. Three counters. Look at our field, no more counters on the board. Oh my. So, but uh, we actually had our last little bit of counters used. And <laughs> barely are surviving. Oh, but the objective is just to survive. If we do that, we'll call it a success. Oh. Alright, looks like he's got we his boss everything. monster. He's He also has everything. Mm hmm. Going to fast food? Actually, he's about to go there. So, so you were. Pop to get two extra you were able to survive this because of Garuda. Mm hmm. Garuda saved us so much. You see, Maxi is good, or not good, but we can play through it because every time they destroy our cards, we get follow up, but he attributed it all. And I'm thinking, how do I get through this? He's got a Fenwar Banish and he's got a Pop with his level 8 monster. He's like, okay, first off, we will go tell him someone out Draco King so we can play around that Pop. And then after I did this, I'm thinking, actually, let me think here. I kind of want to get Draco King off the field or Magistro off the field. If you're using that, I use. I don't use it yet. But the thing is, I wanted to either get Jackal King off so I could use Magister, or get Jackal King away, Jackal away. We actually negate this specifically because we want him to use Fenrir and banish either Magister, Jackal King, or or Jackal. We want him to, to remove a card off the field. And he goes to Magister. I'm like, okay, good. The reason for that is we want to get our skills handy. Can anyone guess what we're going for? Mighty Master. Give you a hint. Not yet. We put him back in the deck. Hmm. And now, um, um, we need to be able to negate that level 8, which can pop a card. Now we have a Jacko King, which puts that card, shuts it down. And look how many counters we have on the board. No. <laughs> and the Invited Master, baby. And now... Dude, this is disgusting. <laughs> Move eight counters, and we've got plenty of counters to negate anything we want still. Unfortunately, though, um, we don't have enough to game. This isn't lethal yet. Oh, I'm thinking, no. okay, just two counters. Nope. But you got, thinking, you okay, got two effect negates and a, and a spawn yep. trap negate, right? Got, got Koei Karo at hand, and he can't play through it. It if was he not used enough. A, a trap negate, I was going to use Endymion to bounce him. No, it's due to time limit. I guess we wouldn't know what would have happened. This is true, y'all. But, I mean, obviously, we know the outcome. Alrighty, y'all. So, another match. Looks like Shadow is going first. Who knows what he's up against. But, Shadow, let us know. Walk us through this hand. Alright. First thing you do. We don't really like to risk too much. I'm thinking, let's just go mastery. And then we can go get our searches if we want. Use Void here, because if you draw into Blue Boy or Knowledge, Secrets can switch the other one and send it from our hand, and we don't have to commit to the, to the field. The normal summon yet. So far, we didn't do. Go ahead and draw two. Now we can trigger Serve and Effect here, but I think I was noticing that he had tr a toggle in his hand. I kept on trying to draw in case he had a... Um, uh, in case he had Maxi. Oh. I wanted to see if I could draw into a card by the grave. I don't think I was able to do it yet. Uh, he had the max. Like, wait, I couldn't draw the card. By. Wait, so far have you been maxied yeah. every game? Yeah, maxi is pretty consistent. You <laughs> but have been people like to say, people say all the time that oh, this deck loses to maxi. This deck hard loses. Oh, be, lucky that you don't put it doesn't have maxi. I'm showing even when I get maxied, ninety percent of the games that I get maxied, I still win just because oh, I yeah. take the challenge. I've seen this deck went through to maxi easy money. I've seen this deck went through yeah. Maxi easily, so... Alrighty, let's go ahead and... That resolved, unfortunately. Mm -hmm. Get out Endymion here. Because we have two Jacko Kings in hand, we gotta start going for um, Endymion stuff. But here's the thing. If he's got a... Um, if he has a... Um, oh yeah. I think, he did, I think I just battled some of the three Jacko Kings here. It's another thing. <laughs> 
only got three, um, two draws off the maxi, and we got four negates on board. Two draws off of maxi and four negates. All right. I mean, three, mm -hmm. three effect negates, one spell and trap, right? Yeah. But it's scale claw. I'm like, okay. I know that. I, I'm just going to stop that too. Yeah, he got two so effects here. Mm-hmm. This is one of those things like, do you, what do you go for? Because this card's not one to turn. I think I let that go through. Yeah. I only got one spell or trap negate. So I'm thinking I gotta use this wisely. Instead of giving them even more draws here. He gets like oh, cross sheep out. He's like, gonna be able to go into his fusion. Spell. Yeah. I stopped that there because then he could just attack over. And if he uses a um, spell card, I can still technically a Deviant Balance Institution and then serve it to Skyde it to put counters on my board already. Stick out one spell trap negate, and we have a monster negate technically. And then he pops the Deviant here. Like, okay, well, we can't use the Deviant negate anymore. Now we only get a monster negate if he activates the spell card. Uh huh. Oh, he gets that to level 8. Hmm. A Drew's right. Room, I think it sends the last monster to gate, so now we don't have any more disruption for the turn. So they can, okay, well, he's breaking the point of the board because of Max D. Wait, what card did he bounce back with? Now we I, probably... didn't, I didn't see that. Oh, yeah, okay. Two. That makes sense. Yeah, I remember now. We get our counters on board, but it doesn't really matter because we don't have any more negates anymore. See, this is what I'm saying. That they can just use all the monster effects first before using the spells and out the board that way. So, but to be honest, Vanadium is one of the, my best matchups because all this stuff is anti monster and this is a spell trap, um, spell kind of deck. Wonderful. Whenever they summon those like Apollo, Bestial Dispater, Barone, I actually am all fine with it. I always pop the board because the Deviant pops up either. Unfortunately Look for at this. him, you still have your scales. Mm-hmm. Look at all he's summoning here. He's not Now done. we just start top decking here. Oh. Alright. Look at all that he's going for. Then he goes for Barone. The basic is one of those. He popped the whole board and now he's going for more. He gets rid of the servant. I'm like, okay. This is he gross. He puts that discount on Magister, which is pretty good. Yeah. He goes to Apollo. But like I said, they're all monster to disrupt. Alright, yo. The only card I have to worry about is Rome. Watch this, okay? Negate. Possible negate. Well, not. Um. Okay, monster negates. But what does Shadow have? <laughs> I have the protagonist powers. I have he the does. card. He does. I'm telling y'all, Shadow is indeed the Mighty Master himself. Draw another Magister. <laughs> I'm like, okay, sure. Magister here. It was the gates. I'm like, okay. But well, Magister's not once per turn, so if I could get three counters on him again, I could just trigger him again. So, like, let's do this real quick. One counter, get Jackal out. Activate Magister, and activate Jackal. They got the scales ready. If you look at Apollo, she points upward. So now we get one, but two monsters that were destroyed. Nice. Real quick, we're just gonna check over you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Now we can do stuff. So now they got the can... uh, the Dispator card. If, nice. you put, if I use Electrolyte's effect to add to the extra deck, you can destroy it. So I don't use the effect yet. It's using the card, it only destroys, it doesn't negate. But I still get the effect to pop and add back. Destroys Electromite, but pop and debt and get Deviant back. Oh no! Uh, oh, oh no! How many counters on the board again? Oh no! <laughs> With two cards, y'all! Damien. Exactly. Pop everything. Okay. And, Let's call it a turn. And a spell and Your move. Mm -hmm. Mister gets this card out. Wimbo, he can summon out Mister Star Loud. He's not giving up without a fight. Uh, here's the thing. He just gave me more follow up. You get a search. Maybe now. add any noble spell. Oh no. This deck is disgusting. Disgusting. 
It was a, basically a full board of uh, Medadia, but we were still able to get out, get out of it. So here it goes. Okay, your move, your top deck. He's like, no, I got full combo here. Let's go Magister first. Magis Magister? But our Dracula King. Now if he has an Ash Blossom for the Magistry, we can just negate it. Let's set another Deviant, okay? Yeah! Pop that board again! <laughs> he saw that Mighty Master, he said, no thank you, this ain't happening a third time, or was that, was, no, second time? I don't know how many yeah. times, that is too many times! Now this has been another match that a lot of you have been asking in the comment sections, how does it deal with Super Heavy Samurai? Now, unfortunately, Shadow's not going second here, but I'm pretty sure Mighty Master would have had something to do with it. Um, but in this case, Shadow's going first, so Shadow, walk us through this duel here. Yeah, so we get Jackal, and we get Upstart, and that we get Mastery. I'm thinking, okay, Magister with Surge Stream, I can use Jackal to summon another gate, Magister summon back Jackal for another gate, and then Jackal summon another third negate. I'm thinking, like, we can do some good stuff here, but then he gets, we get Maxi here. We have to think about what we're going to have to do now. Do we just pass turn, or do we go through Maxi? And if you pause it here, I have to explain to you why, with this scenario, you have to take the challenge here. In this specific scenario, Jackal King has no counters, so you're basically going to have to use a card to be hand, like Magister, for two game counters. Because if you don't get any counters on Jackal King, they can just go through all the monster effects, and then, you know, Jackal King without using a spell card. Is Magister to give it that counter, but then we just have Void Bestiary Institution. Gate, monster gate is just not enough to play to stop an opponent's end board. So basically, they're going to play through that negate, and they're going to stop your Jackal King and Magister, so you just have Void Bestial Institution. Those cards are not good enough at all to go against um, a Fortified Discussion board. And instead of using six cards, which you can go second against with six cards, you now only have three or four cards that can stop your opponent's board. So here, you actually have to take the full challenge here, so you can get out enough negate to stop your opponent. But that's not terrible because this deck does those summons really fast. You can summon five to six to gate and about only four summons. And every time you give your opponent a card, you basically can just take that card away because it's in the gate. Every time your opponent destroys your card like a Debian, you get you get follow up. Debian gets a normal spell. Magister and Servant go back to the scales so you don't lose anything. Jackal King um, puts count as institution. So basically, every time you summon a negate, it's basically removing two cards to your opponent's hand. So you're actually counteracting the max C. You have to take the full max C challenge and only do four or five uh, summons because that's how many that's how many this deck needs to get out the whole end board. So about uh, to show what we do. Alright, let's take a look and let's see how many cards they end up in hand. We go void here. Get another void, which is okay, that's good. More counters. Now we get Citadel. And Citadel basically it gets us protection on all our counters too. Over here. Are they drawn, oh, they... Why does summon another? In case it's not like. Yeah. They've drawn three now? That is. Mm -hmm. And instead of going for Electromite, we could actually just summon our other negate with Servant here. Because Electromite would be two more summons, and then we have to get another high skill. This is one of those scenarios where it's not. It's uh, perfectly fine just to go for the Servant effect negate. And every single time you put a negate on board, it's basically you can remove it from the field already because you can just negate what they draw. Alrighty, so how many now, cards did they end up drawing? How many here? cards? In the end? Three, four, five. So they only have eight cards. If you just hold down the I button, oh, look at yeah. the I button on the bottom right. You can hold that down and see how many cards. Wait, did eight they cards. did they draw already? So they only we gave them four draws. Four draws. That's it. That's not actually terrible. Yeah. I mean, it's terrible, mm -hmm. but but we summoned four negates off. So you got four negates here, spell and trap negate, yeah, two, and effect ne two effect negate, spell uh -huh. and trap negate, and then I guess, is this optional here? With Magister? Yeah, Magister can summon either one, or a reflection from the deck that can bounce. So okay. I think it's also very important to know about It's all about, you know, getting enough counters for follow-up, but you gotta make sure you get to that follow-up. So right now, you don't even wanna focus on the old combo pieces, you actually wanna focus on cards that might be able to board break you. Evenly match a lightning storm, you want to make sure you keep a negate for cards like that or Zeus. Make sure you play around those. It doesn't matter if they summon out their whole deck, if you can have Magister serve it in the scale with the Endemian spell and institution and Citadel. If you have all your follow up set up, they can go full combo. And if you got the cards there, you can break their board just like you're going second regularly. 
But the thing you want to hope for is cards like Evilly Match, Zeus, um, and Rejeki, those cards. Rejeki doesn't hurt that bad because they go to the extra deck. But cards that destroy your follow-up is what you want to go after. And then after that, your second priority is to take care of their combo pieces. So pretty That's much you sur after. survive the turn as a worst case scenario because mm -hmm. you're going to cook them afterwards. Yeah. All right. So here yeah. you have two, objective survive. Yeah, you have two effect negates, uh, potentially three or two and spell and trap negates and two effect negates. So I guess you have the choice mm -hmm. here. All right. Let's see what super heavy samurai does against Endymions. Got that. Right. I'm like, okay. Well, if I go through, we gotta figure combo. out what we did negate. You always want to negate for the effect as well, and they can. That's one card. It runs into bolts, but we have to negate that. And he has oh, the gamma. I was like, right. okay, we not go through either. So that's two we negates. Need two now. of our negates right off the bat. Mhm. Mm Pop that negate negate. We still got Jaku King, and since a is about to turn servant, I just can summon anything from the deck. But we gotta wait until we know what we gotta go after. But they can, okay, the Super Heavy Samurais, let's get another Monster Negate. We're gonna need it. So we still got two Monster Negates and plenty of counters. So here you opted for the Monster Negate, obviously, because it's Super Heavy Samurai. Mm -hmm. Exactly. We gotta figure out, we gotta use this wisely. I know, I said, I know that's a one card combo. Um, a card could just summon back from thinking, okay, let's just get rid of that card, because obviously it's multiple. It's as you can get. And without any board breakers, um, like Lightning Storm and Evilly, we don't have to worry about those. We can now focus on hitting their, um, uh, their combo pieces. So I gotta use that last negate wisely, making sure that they don't just go out of the blue and summon out a card that can remove everything. Gotta pedal summon everything. If you had Garuda in hand, all those cards would be bounced right back to the hand. Would have been beautiful. Oh, that would have been nice. Didn't. Yeah. Garuda on a Pendulum Summon is like the second best feeling in the world. And Demian Pop being the first. <laughs> yeah. We've seen Fortunately, that several though, times. <laughs> exactly. Uh -oh. Actually, he goes to a Savage Dragon. I'm thinking, I gotta negate the next thing. We gotta negate that. But then he chain blocks in Soul Fuser. Like, we gotta negate that. We don't have another, we don't have another try. try. Now, we could have um, waited, you know, for something else to see if we could spread out that one Savage Dragon negate. I did not want to give him the option to determine whether negating um, Jackal King or letting Jackal King resolve was better. I wanted to make sure the first thing that happened would stop him. Aren't they going to Unicorn? So that. That's back to Citadel. Citadel is now gone, so that follow-up is now gone. The best cards to hit in this deck is Citadel Institution, because they're the best cards to follow up. And they can just pop a Jackal King first to put Kato's Institution. But he pops institution first. Like, what are we gonna do here? He knew what he was doing but too. Now, magic. Oh, well, he knew he was doing. He wouldn't go after the Endymion cards because they are all uh, follow up. Yeah. But he uses up his negate because the Endymion would search any normal spell. Now, that's basically all I can do here. We got three Jacksons on the field. We just gotta figure out how we just how we how would we like oh. to OTK? How <laughs> we like to OTK? He's just checking the menu real fast, y'all. Exactly. What's on board here? Oh, we have a nice petal of stone soup. Alright. Looks like he's petal of something. Yeah, what the heck? what's up with that? That's how Mighty Master. Like, Mighty, what is my turn? Mighty Master is too strong. He's like, yeah, you don't petal of summon me. The opponent does. Exactly. All right, so you return. I'll use my opponent skills to summon myself. Exactly. Yep. Now we get rid of one monster. Let's hey, y'all, if y'all yeah, have been, you. we had a lot of questions. Oh, well, too bad, yeah, Super Heavy Samurai. A lot of people ask how they summon Chaos Angel. Y'all just saw that in action, y'all. Uh huh. Chaos Angel is just there in case the situation arises, but when it does, he's amazing. Alrighty, y'all. So for this match here, it looks like Shadow is also going second, y'all. For the disbelievers out there, and if you're new to this video and you think this deck loses to Max, see, we proved that wrong. You say this deck loses to going second. I have seen this deck go second and win so many times. On top of that, we do have a, a video dedicated to this deck going second, and it is several duels. Several duels that look almost impossible, and it just 
wins anyways let's see who shadow is up against on this one. Oh, is this is this math this is math mech y'all the math one mech. card combo this math he needs to be banned already circular needs to be banned already mm -hmm. for the people that said uh diameter was the right choice uh okay that's all right yeah. so it looks the like that super pack toil it searched with what on the way it just gets super pack toil but you can get rid of four cards your opponent has it's kind of just kind of crazy looks like the typical route here so far let's see mm -hmm. if uh this math mech player spices it up a little bit i have seen some spicy math mech combos Oh, he's going. Get oh, okay. Run. Gets rid of my servant. My servant. <laughs> it's like, like, okay, what are we gonna do now? Our hand is kind of like not as good as it was before. That is he's interesting. Still got a super factorial, but... mm -hmm. Super factorial already gets rid of two cards. No, the one in the hand, and one in the field, and then the diamond gets rid of the third. Then he just set the, the um. I was just good over fourth. All right, so he's so got a negate in grave. Got... He's got super yeah, factorial. He's dipped into your hand and got rid of mm. one of the better cards. Um, yeah, the best card in the hand. <laughs> okay, he's got two set cards. He's got another set card. He's got one card in hand. And then what does he got with this guy here? Firewall Dragon. He can send another negate um, from his extra deck to the graveyard and negate again. He can send that XZ monster, which says if this card is sent to the graveyard, Target a face of card, you put a control to negate its effect. Okay. He's got a negate with a trap, a negate with fire that is sent to with uh, his extra Z, his super factorial card. Right. Diameter, another negate. So he has a way to get five cards. And a way to get into your hand again. Alright, yep. let's see how you how you played through this. Negates institution. Which would have gotten me any card I needed um, with uh, Cyber with Cerberus and Bachelor. But there it's gone. Like, let's go. We gotta start collecting counters on our cards. Let's serve it back again. Go Desires. Hopefully that can get us more cards that we could use. We didn't get any card vibes, unfortunately. It's like, I don't wanna... If I summon Jackal, he summon, uses the trap card and sends Jackal away anyway. I think we gotta use this now. And he uses the Super Factorial. Now... After this, I thought maybe the right play would've been to use Reflection. Because since I have priority, play a priority. Use reflection about servant and his XZ, then he would have had a choose between negating to reflection or sending cards to the graveyard. It would have got rid of the negate regardless. But instead I still went for Jacko King, so I can try to negate and use up the diameter of negate. Okay. So here he still has a negate as well. Oh well you get to negate this. Very nice. Um, yeah, so I can force it out. Alright, well he still takes a card from your hand. Yeah. Uh-huh. So here by the Still in graveyard gets rid of one card. Factorial and Jack in that one gets rid of two cards. He's got another negate here, but he misuses it, so I'm like, okay, sure. Oh, nice, yeah, and I, okay, all right. It is hopefully that this can get us what we need. The so bash this. Pop it and get us one more draw here. Ooh. The electromic can get us another draw. It's like, we used Magister already. Magister, we used the ser Servant, so that was a dead card. Um. Instead, we go Jacko King. Pop it. Put a Bachelor's back. And remember, we used the Spellbook Engine, I think. So oh, we go... I don't recall the Spellbook Engine. Did you? I don't think it was Spellbook. Oh. No, no, I, I think we sent... We build the Spellbook card. Yeah, okay. Uh, we build Service. Yeah, no. It wasn't the Spellbook stuff. They're thinking, instead of just going for access code, let's get rid of another oh, card. Oh, nice. Anima. Okay. Oh, nice. That's gross. That was a free. That was a free feel. We still got access code. So you just play through about five, like, hand loops, basically. That's I'm nuts. Sure that. He had Carver the Grave in case he got disrupted. Is that like, no, we're going to use it again. Get rid of that card. Oh, let me get, we got fusion was one disruption. The um, super toy was two and three. He could have negated the, uh, with diameter with the fourth. And then he had the uh, the, the his singularity with the fifth one because he said the X is Z. And he also hand looped me during turn one. So that was a way to deal with six cards in my hand. 
already. And that was all with like one card combo. Not only did he play through and, all those disruptions, but those two cards dipping into a hand, I bet really hurt. Mm -hmm. That was the best card he could have gotten with it. That is disgusting, mm -hmm. y'all. Just you're seeing it here. It just. Anyways, uh -huh. let's see though. What does the opponent have? I know Mathmac or uh, Cyber's cards. They only need a single card. Mm -hmm. What's stronger, the heart of the cards or the heart of the algorithm? Oh my goodness! All right, what is he? Oh my it's goodness! Sick of back again. You want to fast forward this? Let's... Uh... Oh, he's gonna get. He's gonna One. go all out, huh? Uh huh. But he used his um. It's Transco Talker, which summons from the Graveyard. He's got three, but he needs Transco Talker to do that. He already uses one of them, oh, and he's gone. He doesn't have, he didn't have anything else because he's used the majority of his extra deck. GG's to the mm -hmm. poor opponent. Alrighty, y'all. So that's going to be it for the video. Again, Shadow, thank you so much for doing this with us and bringing this Master 1 Endymion deck that is... Y'all, by the way, every season master one endymions and shadow actually streams this live on his switch channel so for the non-believers i think he might be using this deck you know only for a few matches and then playing something else shadow runs this and he live streams these um every single time he does stream so y'all check him out i'll link the twitch link for his channel down below i'll link mine as well please follow the both of us we'd really appreciate it follow shadow on master duel y'all he truly is the endymion master or let me reword it here this spell counter master um, because a lot of people Back. can run Endymions with other stuff. He is the master of spell counters. Uh, but thank you so much, Shadow. Thanks again for having me on, Anam. I'm glad to be able to showcase the replays. I only ever really rank climb when I am streaming, so I can show that this deck is the deck I get to Master 1 consistently with. But I don't use Astrograph of any of those cards, and that's probably one of the reasons why this deck can play through Maxi a lot as well. I do this deck on Twitch, and when I am streaming the deck, I actually go through each of... I plays and if people are actually looking for ways to enhance their moves, I actually explain all my thought processes and very specific things to look forward to. And I also have a lot of other amazing duels that I go on Twitch that don't really make the replays. If you guys do want to follow and watch more, there are some incredible gameplays I have on there. And also for anyone else who's looking to pick up this deck, this deck is basically immune to the ban list. The Powder Desires hit from 2 to 1, this deck already used it at 1. If you're looking for a deck that can strong, that can compete with everything, and you can use it for time and time again, I've been using this deck since Season 1 with almost no changes. So this is definitely a deck to pick up. So hopefully you guys learned something new, and I'm glad you're able to watch. Thank you so much again, Shadow. I'm sure that everybody appreciates it. I know that I do. Again, y'all follow Shadow on Twitch. Follow him on Master Duel. Please do the same for me. I would really appreciate it. Like the video. Comment down below. It helps out a ton. And we will continue to put out Endymion content as long as Shadow is willing to help me out with these. Stay tuned also for maybe another TCG deck list. As Shadow did get first place in his locals. Or I think he said it was a tournament. So stay tuned for that video, y'all. We'll do another TCG de deck list. I know the last one was pretty successful. And a lot of people did like that one. So stay tuned for that. Again, thank y'all so much. Catch y'all on the next one.